All right. Hey guys, what's up? Evil Zombie here. Welcome to another kind of unboxing review video of some dice and some stuff I got from Dice Envy. So I got some different stuff this time and I wanted to go over all of it with you. So I'm at my D&D table. Yes, this is a TV. Yes, I made this and yes, the knife is sexy. So first things first, I got a sticker. I like stickers. Normally I give them to my girls because I have two kids and they love stickers i have these i have this exact sticker like everywhere in my house and i, I like it we like lions they're cool <laughs> my kids love it so something new that i've never shown that i've never gotten before from the, from them they now have dice trays and i think that's cool because this is extremely portable like it was in a long flat box and i'm like ooh, <laughs> it's in a flat box it's a different style of packaging well oh, that's that's sexy well that feels good Ah, toss it down there. That feels really good. It's like a material. You can see my fingerprints on it, too. Okay, so first let's show off and look at the detail. Ooh, it's shiny. The Just the logo is nice and shiny. Kind of like a nicer plastic kind of thing. It doesn't feel cheap. I could probably scratch it if I tried really hard. Um, but no, it's nice. This all feels good. It has a nice little bit of weight to it. In the back, looks like leatherette. It's all stitched though, so it's nice. I like the stitching work. The stitching work's pretty nice and it has the um, kind of like embedded symbol here, or like their logo, you know, on all four parts. I can see the magnets right here and here and on the other side as well. So I can tell that it's going to go up and over, then clip. So it just, it goes, oh yeah, I didn't clip it. And up, over, and clip. And there's the dice tray. And does it, does it come loose? A little bit if I move it around a lot, but that's because I'm picking it up. Can I pick it up by the end? Yes, I can. Just not as much on these sides because that's where the magnets are. But if you do this, it's fine. And to go with that, oh yeah. Also, I've already shown you guys these before, but these are like combat trackers and stuff like that for DMs to keep track of everything. So it keeps track of how many spell slots are used and stuff, uh, how many hit points and all that stuff, how many inspiration points each person has, what death save they're on. It's just like a little sheet to keep track of the players. And I got a pad of these also. These are from Dice Envy as well. I have them on there. Um, all these things, I'm an affiliate. Uh, I'm not sponsored, but I, I am an affiliate, so all the stuff here was brought to you by them. So thank you, Dice Envy. Um, but yeah, they sent me over the stuff to review, and I'm just kind of showing it off because I'm excited, and I do use it in all my games. Like, this one, I got this whole thing I got from Forged, but all the dice inside here right now are all from Dice Envy. I, I love them. They're fantastic people, and they're really cool. I watch their Twitch streams. They do different games and stuff. I was watching a Star Wars game they were doing a while back also. That was cool. So still, dice. Let's see. I'm do, okay, this feels like the 10-piece set. This feels like the metal set. I did mystery sets, so I can show you guys, and you get to see it with me. Let's do... Let's do the 10-piece uh, set. 10-piece set first. Ooh. Ooh, shiny. There we go. Let's get that opened up. And pour them all out. Okay, so all the 10-piece sets come with um, two different... D okay, we'll start from the top. It comes with a chunky D20. Look at that bad boy. I'll move my light a little bit so you can see a little nicer. I like the swirly. I like the swirly. It's cool. This one doesn't seem to have a line on the end of it. A lot of them do. Um, does this one? Where's the 20? There it is. Nope. Does not have a line on the end of it, but still nice and sparkly and swirly. Those are the two D20s. Then you have your D12. You have your two D. Wait. There's your two D10s over here. Ah, I can't grab it at the same time. Your two D10s over here, uh, your D8. Then their 10-piece sets have two D6s. One of them is bigger than the other one, and it has that cool lion symbol. Okay. Then we got um, one of the regular D4s, and we have what they like to call the Infinity Dice, or the Infinity D4. So these are much easier to pick up. These are not a pain in the butt, because they never land on this side. Those are rounded. 
So Dice Envy sells these, and I love these because I hate picking up these kind. If you have the little metal ones, like, like those, it's hard to pick them up normally if your hands are sweaty, you know? But these, it's easy. I like them. So there's the set of dice from here. Let's do some rolls. I had to pick up the D4. Wonderful. I like it. <laughs> I can just sweep them all up the side here. Cool. I like that. I like that. <laughs> I'll put the bag over there. Now here's the metal ones, the mystery set. Cha. Ooh, they're all individually wrapped. That's nifty. It might take me a minute. But you guys get that. Oh my goodness, they are all individually wrapped. One sec. Okay, they're all, all undone by magic. <laughs> so, first I want to show you up close what they look like. Look at that. That is really nice. I like that. The D6 is probably the easiest one to see details on because it's the big guy. Nice. I like it. I like it a lot. Um, they all feel nice and weighty. I think there's ink. But they all have a nice bit of weight to them. Nice, a 12. Uh, 16. 18. I'm rolling well with this one. Nat 20. There we go. I'll end it on the Nat 20. I like it. I like them a lot. These, these actually look really cool. I really like these dice. I'm attracted to these dice a lot. The 20 on this is also not a lion, it's a regular 20. But still, it's okay, it looks good. It feels good. I'm probably gonna roll with these next game just for fun of it. I'm excited to see how that goes. Ah. Oh yes, also, in the description below, you'll see like the affiliate link for Dice Envy, and you'll see my coupon code, or discount code, 10% off if you use the code ZOMBIE. Uh, because I'm Evil Zombie. Oop, there we go, one of my, one of my eyelash hairs got in there somehow. I don't even know how. It's fine. But yes, I like this. This is really cool. And I can just stack it underneath my books when I'm not using it. I really like that. That's cool. <laughs> because normally I carry around this. Because it's the lid for my other one. So a lot of times I'll use, the, like for big dice rolls, I'll use my D20s in there, you know? Because a lot of times I also use this I got from Dice Druid. They make cool personalized dice bags. Because they're badass at Dice Druid. Takes them a while to ship things, but they're cool. Let's see, here's one of the wooden dice from Dice Envy. This one's made of paddock. I like it, I love this dice. A lot of times I just roll on this. It's a nice tray, I have no complaints about it. I love the tray. But it's like a whole package. You have to have the big heavy thing with you. It's not portable. So yeah, ooh, 18. I clunk it on there. And I just suck at doing this today. Still, it's coming out nice. Not bad. This, yes, this is a bag of all chunky dice. A lot of chunky dice. So with that, I just waited till they undid, well, till they stopped their car. So here's all my chunky dice. The only one I did not get from Dice Envy was this one. I got this for like five bucks on Amazon or something. But here's all my chunky ones. These all came from. Uh, Dice Envy, I had more, but I gave a couple sets away to like my niece and um, yeah, just different friends that needed dice and yeah, that's kind of what I like to do. So, yeah, these, let's see, I'd probably say these ones are my primary ones a lot of the time. If I'm playing as a monster, a regular monster, a lot of times I'll use the gelatinous psychosahedron. I love this one, it's cool. Check it out, it has like a little warrior inside. Yeah, it's awesome. I can't, I don't know if it really captures it well in the video, but it kind of looks gooey when you're looking at it. Which is why it's gelatinous. This is what I use for Strahd von Zorovich. Uh, from the Curse of Strahd campaign. And this one does have a little lion. I like it. This is from the bone set of dice that I use. I have the dice box. Right here. Strahd's dice go in my little coffin I made. It came out nice. Yes, that's where all Strahd's dice are. Can I close it with this? I don't think I can. No, not quite. I tried. That's why it stays in the other bag. But yeah, I like Dice Envy. They're fun. So check out their stuff. Um, dice boxes and stuff and dice rollers. A lot of times you can get them over at, uh, what's it called? Also with the discount code Forge Gaming. But Dice Envy, they're fantastic. I like their stuff. And I'm so happy that they finally have a dice tray. 
It took them a long time. They haven't had a dice tray. I've been waiting years to have a dice tray. Because I like the I like Dice Envy. They make good stuff. I like it. And yeah, now I'm excited. I'm probably gonna get a couple more of these. They'll have one for each side of my table, you know? Yeah, I can send one home with my players. They'll, they'll like that. That'll be fun. I like doing D&D. D&D is fun. This is my favorite pastime. Ooh, how the big metal chonky boys look? Nice. Ooh, got 20. See? Good stuff. I like that. <laughs> Let's end on the net 20. Anyways, guys, thanks for watching. I just want to show off the new thing I got. I was excited. And I figured, what the hell? I'll try and market it a little bit too because I can. Also, this I got on Amazon. And this I got on Etsy. I had to hot glue all the magnets to myself. And this one got a little burnt. But it's okay. I, I store some extra dice in there. And this. Ooh, I'll show you this. I'll show you this. It's always very satisfying. It's always very satisfying to roll it so I gotta put all this away because you need to see this okay this is 45 d6s I want to get five more of them because I think I have a little bit of room left on the top I store them all inside here These, I buy out all of Walmart stock of dice every time they stock up so let's do this thing Yes, that was satisfying. I love it. <laughs> Anyways, guys, I'll see you later. Have a good one. If you have any questions about dice, if you want to see more of them, if you want to see slow-mo videos of dice pouring, I have an OnlyFans that is literally... I'll give you the link for it if you want. It's literally only about dice. I did the white ones already where it's a nice slow-mo roll and everything. I do a sl uh, extreme slow motion thing, HD pictures of it, all that. If you have certain sets you want to see done in that style, then tell me in the comments and I'll put those on the on the OnlyFans thing. So, yeah. Have fun, guys. See you guys later. Bye.